What's up everybody, it's Ben here with SRKCycles.com and today I have a 2016 Harley Davidson Road Glide. Uh, we're gonna take a quick walk around this thing so you can see it up close and personal. Just got this thing in. It's got like right around 40,000 miles on it. It's a pretty nice machine. It's got a few things here and there I wanna point out but let's just get started here in the back tire. Tons and tons of tread on that back tire. Good to go for a long time. Of course you have your, uh, you have your rear exhaust there. There is a, sm a small, little dent it's hard to see it right there on that rear exhaust uh, of course you have your got your tail lights and of course you have up here on the turn pack I think the I think the turn signals are up here in the turn pack the tour pack somewhere um, so you have that uh, I'm gonna light little mark right there that I want to point out it's a little hard to see and then there's some other little like little specks here on the rear fender that I wanted to point out. Like I said, they're a little bit hard to see on the video, but they are there. You can see a couple of them there. Don't know what caused that. Uh, there's one over here, a couple in the rear bag too. Um, coming up to the tour pack. Of course, you have that chrome luggage holder up there. There's the inside of the tour pack. One really cool thing about this bike is this guy took really good care of it. Of course, you have the keys of the intercom things. It does have the adjustable air suspension. Guys, this is the pump for that. These don't come with the bike, usually, when we get them. I mean, they come new with the bike. But this guy kept it, and used it, and used it well. Put me back in there. Don't want to lose that after I, after I mentioned it in the video. Of course, you have all the, all the pockets and stuff up here. Got the tool kit. I mean, this guy has the tool kit. No one leaves that stuff in place. So there's that. Lock it back up. Uh, here on the, the top of the bag, pretty decent shape. Got one little mark right here at my pointer finger I want to point out. Obviously we can open that up. See in there you got the, uh, the luggage bags there. And there is a scratch right here along this bag. Easy one to hide. It's, I mean, it's pretty much impossible to see when the bag is closed, but it is there. Um, here on the side of the bag, all this stuff is nice. You can see your exhaust there, looking good. All the way up to the motor. Just have the, uh, with the leather pouch there, zipper pouch, all that. You get the passenger floorboard, you get the rider floorboard, you get that rear brake. In here, you got the, uh, got that side cover. Well, that's in pretty decent shape. Of course you have this engine shield. Got a, that little white mark there on the engine shield. So up here on the tank, I, there's like this weird little fading going on here. I don't know what caused this, but it is there. Um, I tried to wipe down. I did not try to buff it. It might just buff right out, but it is there. And you got these light little marks up here in the front of the tank. Other than that, tank's in decent shape. Of course that's the 103 motor. Got your air cleaner, all that stuff the motor as much as I can there's that of course you have the, uh, the foot fairings with the uh, those I know these things close I feel kind of dumb but I don't know how to do it for the video but such is life of course you have your uh, you have your glove compartment up here You've got the uh, USB plug uh, let's spin it around just a little bit of course you can see that front fender there. Nice shape, got the front wheel, front brake. Seeing the top of the fender, you can see that that's in pretty decent shape. One little mark there right at my pointer finger and one right there. Other than that, looking good. Got that front tire, tons of tread left just like the back tire. Spin it around a little bit. Over here, you can see a little bit of those fork tubes. They are in nice shape. Again, there's that front brake up close. See this side, more of the same. And there's front brake on that side. Got the dual rotors up front. There's that upper fairing, of course, it has the LED headlights. It's a nice looking bike. Like I said, there's some little, there's got a little mark in there. There's some little things on the bike that I wanted to point out, but overall, this is a really, really nice machine. And for being a 2016, having like 39-ish or 40,000 miles, it is not bad. There's your lower fairing. Of course, in here you have your rider, your rider floorboard, toe shifter, heel shifter. 
You got the passenger floorboard. Of course, you got the battery tender. Always good to keep it hooked up. The motor from this side. That V twin. You have that transmission. And you have that exhaust coming all the way to the back. Of course, you got the leather pouches on this side. It's like the water bottle holder. Here's the bags, too. Bags looking good on this side. Open that up. Light little mark right there on the inside of the bag. Got the cover, whatnot. There you go. Side of the tour pack. So guys, this brings you to the seat. I want to talk a little bit about this seat because this is not just your everyday seat. This is the Harley Davidson Road Zeppelin seat. This is air controls right here for driver and for passenger. Uh, controls the firmness of the seat. This is like an $800 upgrade. I know we don't charge you for upgrades, but this is a really, really nice feature. Plus the backrest for the rider, and it's in really, really nice shape. Backrest, passenger seat, and rider seat, all in nice shape. Coming over the top, of course you have your fuel cap, got your clutch, all your controls, there's your throttle, brakes, it does have the heated hand grips here. Turn this thing on, there you go, it's a 39 or 40, it is 39,979 miles, it's going to roll over 40k, there might be a few more than that after Sean's test drive, make sure you check out the test drive on YouTube if you're interested in this bike. Let's fire this thing up. these turn signals work. Turn signal on that side in the front. Turn signal on this side in the front. There you got that that rear turn signal on the tour pack. And got the other side on the tour pack. Alright guys like I said this is a 2016 Harley Davidson a Road Glide Ultra almost 40,000 miles on it. This thing will be priced to sell. If you're interested in this bike, make sure you check out the test drive video and check out the bike at srkcycles.com. Thanks so much for watching.